going on YouTube? We're coming back at you guys with another Railroads Online video. Today, this is episode 21 of our Let's Play series. Now, it kind of feels like the last couple of videos I've been doing updates for you guys, which I don't have a problem with it. But today, we have snow in the beta version of Railroads Online. So, let's get basically right into what is new here um i haven't really looked into what is new like the uh deals but i kind of get the idea so there's a snowplow which we shall be able to get which is pretty cool pretty cool and change the paint on it like that nice wood rustic look there we'll probably be buying this red one honestly you know that's what we're kind of into we're getting the red red uh red plow to match a red train there and they also added a new locomotive cook 280 so we have two cooks now this guy here 130 psi boiler pressure 11,872 tractive effort compared to 13,000 here but that is pretty cool to see it looks like it's a longer tender and whatnot as well always fun to see always fun to see and i kind of like the look of the, the paint there um i was told by one of my subscribers to not get the green one it's more of a festive look i'm gonna say it's this one here kind of a weird green but i was also told there's a little light lamp holders right there as well so that's pretty neat to see uh, if we do buy this, are they going to be have to be the first or the second uh, version there? Uh, we got a couple different headlights. And I honestly didn't check how much money I had before we ran it, ran this. Kind of like the original one there. So what, well, how many engines do we got now? Was this seven? Give me a second. Let me look. Let me see what how many engines we got. All right, it is number engine or engine number seven. Oh, hello, hello, darkness, my old friend. The Flyboy. Shall we name it the Flyboy? Uh, I don't know where. Oh, it's right up here. Ah. Okay. I like what I see. Let's hit the order button. See if we can buy it. And we are down bad with money. Oh, we purchased the new loco. Let's get on down there and take a look, shall we? I'm going to get in the uh, telegraph office here, and I will meet you guys down there. All right. We done teleported over here. Or, I mean, we uh, done hit up the telegraph here and had our guy come over here. And we're going to have him prep the loco for us. And let's just take a quicker look or a nice look at it here. So I'm going to turn around here. I haven't even put any fire in it yet. So the fly boy, engine number seven here. And we are chilling. We are chilling. So let's go ahead and take a step up. Um, I'm going to leave that break on. I'm going to slap that door open. Ooh. Nice little look in here. Nice little look. I'm going to take that break off uh, just because we don't really need that one. I'm going to take a look and see what we all got here. I think it's just like the other one, just do it. All right, let's go ahead and pop this open. And let's get this fire warmed up. And we should get get rolling here. So we got a lot of locos in our in our uh, inventory here. What is that? Um did we order a uh, snow plow without knowing? Hmm. I suppose we have a snow plow. 
Look at this beast. Look at this beast. So it is in or number 99. I didn't really know what number to number it. But it kind of looks like water would go in there. If I'm not mistaken. Or sand, maybe. Probably sand. Not water. Uh, sand. Probably pop in there. I'm not sure. Uh, let me know what you guys, um, if you guys have any knowledge on this. I, I honestly don't know. Would sand go in this? Is this like a sander for it? Let's see here. Do we see any? Do some context clues here. So if it is used as a sander, um, necessarily we get a, we'd have to look and see. I don't think you know. Okay, so we got our, you know, our standard coupler there. And right here, we have some marker lights. Oh, there's an orange one. And we have that light as well. I like those orange ones. All right. And we got the stamp of approval. L&M Co. 1885. The cook. All right. And the nice looking tender here. We got the orange one. Ooh. I think we're going to do red, though. Yeah. We'll do red in the back and orange in the front. Just like a normal traffic light. No, I'm just kidding. Anyways. But, yeah, that's the Cook. Cook Mogul 280. You guys have any knowledge on this? Be happy to share it down in the comments and to spread some knowledge on the viewers there. Uh, one other thing. Thing they added. I'm just gonna look through here because I didn't look myself. Alright, so one other thing they added. Oh look, you can see it in the background there. That's so cool. Uh they added this. So they nerfed the Mosca is what I was told. We're just gonna take a look at that. 8,611. So and all necessarily got nerfed to a little bit over the Glenbrook. But that is okay. We can still use her. We'll still love her. Uh, but I th think we're going to be using the, uh, the mogul here for the most part. Um, and then we still have our class 70. Chillin'. Got that in our back pocket there. Um, but this will probably be maybe the next season. Who knows? But all right, let's go ahead and get right into it. Um, I honestly, at the moment here, I won't have any idea what we're going to be doing. Um, I kind of just wanted to cover the deal and we will see where we can go. All right, so for today's video, it's going to be, it's not too much progress. Uh, it's just going to be a little recap. Well, not a recap, but um, yeah. So as we were uh, traveling down here, uh, one of the guys here, they said that the uh, tracks out there are a bit icy. So we're going to need to take the plow out here and we're going to be plowing some snow. Quote unquote snow. Uh, we're going to be plowing some snow and just make a little episode out of it make it a little skit here so i hope you guys enjoyed the show here um not gonna be too long here see how it goes um but we shall get right into it all right she is all good to go we gotta go get the mosca unstuck from the iron mine there's a snow passage blocking and we gotta go take it up gotta go take care of it let's get on in the cook here the 280 and close that door because it is dang cold outside. And let's get on rolling. All right. We'll do 20% on the reg for right now. Let's get out of here. I'll get on this view here. 
You guys probably want to see some action rolling. So as you may hear, there is some snow blowing, some snow plowing going on. All right, I do not recommend standing over here, but we'll probably in the next the next time we do a plow video, we'll probably use the tug bug just because it is a lot. I don't know. It, is, it seems a lot more uh, suitable for this. Uh, so it does have some visual glitches, but it, there for the most part, you guys can hear the scraping of the snow getting the snow off the tracks and we are going uh, before I started this video I honestly didn't know this was a part of it I thought they just added the plow but that is pretty cool to see just to see the smoke and whatnot go through um, hopefully the plow gets the switches set as well uh, let's check it here we're good we're good oh yeah as you guys may see the snow is flying we are flying through tracks i'm gonna run over and do we have a door on the side yeah, we don't have a door but be nice getting this view here and we are cruising so as you may see the snow is blown the snow's rolling i'm gonna go ahead and take off the rag pulling up the snow or the sawmill there holy crap this train is fast I am excited to see what this train has in store. It's probably going to replace the Mosca. Oh no. Oh, out with the old, in with the new, I suppose. We need to see if we can get up there past the switch. Get this thrown so we don't have to go through the uh, sawmill there. Just scraping on through. Let's go get the Mosca unstuck. Come on, Cook. I love the lights in the back there. It is a beautiful. Right. I'm going to bump up the reg again. And we are going. So if you guys haven't already checked out Aardvark Games, uh, his channel there, he does have, he does post a lot more Railroads Online content than I do. But I do recommend checking him out as well. Other than that, we're just vibing. We're hanging out. Doing some snow plows. And we're going to go down to the uh, iron mine here. Get the Mosca unstuck. And get on to it. So if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys hit that like button. Today, let's try to get the likes up to 60 likes. I know that's a lot of likes. I know that's a lot of asking. But it does mean a lot to me if we can get up to those likes. It will help out the algorithm the videos and the channel and whatnot will help me out and it does mean a lot to me it means a lot to me you guys are here hanging out with me and just vibing and we are just you know we're snow plowing. so we're uh going we're doing the things we're getting all the snow all done here i'm not mistaken this was red so i like how it looks like a snow snowed over red there so i'm gonna probably take off Greg here. Do we have a compressor? We do. Do we have a generator? We don't. Alright. As you guys may hear, the scraping of the snow as we go. You know. Let's go. Alright. So we're going to be going down a hill here. Uh, mind the visual effects. Would sit. I would stand right here, but unfortunately, somebody needs to drive this dang train. Uh, but like up the hill, we could probably just keep her open. As you may see, as you slow down, the snow slows down as well. You get out of this view. Into this one. All right. We're gonna have to use some. We gotta use some force here. We're we're plowing some snow. We gotta use some force. But like I said, I would stand right there if, or I can control the train from there. But unfortunately, I can't. So we'll just kind of have to look and watch the visuals as they go. 
But at the moment, we're flying. We're getting the snow plowed. And we are just, you know, we're having fun. Oh. Huh. Okay. 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 So we can't go too fast. Got it. Let's do the second attempt here. Ugh. All right. Well, the snow plot doesn't have any brakes. So we're going to be, uh, Queuing the music here and Jason after it, I guess. No music here. Uh, we'll just be going here on the vibe. Oh, I'm proud of you, little snow plow. Go, little snow plow. All right. <laughs> wasn't for the visuals, it would have looked pretty cool. So I found out the cook is a little too powerful. So you got to baby it with the reg. Or with the reverse rush, let's say. But this is going to be a nice brute to uh, handle on for future things to come. Which would be nice to see here. So it made it around the hump and whatnot. That's pretty cool. Pull the whistle and make sure the uh, uh, the snowplow doesn't know where uh, knows we're not taking it by surprise here. So we will pull it up. We've got the bell going, and we'll give it a nice little smack. All right, let's get back in the cook and see what we need to do to get a nice plow in, but also not. Um, okay, so, having some starting problems here. We are going to do that, and the reg up. All right, got to start slow. Got to start slow on the hills. Come on, man. You know this. All right, let's get the snow off the bridge here, hopefully. Pick up the pace here. Get that snow going. As you may see. The musk. Or not the musk. Well, Cook 280. Putting in some work. Doing the thing. And let's get going. I think we we're just going too quick for it. baby the all right so we'll baby the reverser there and we will use that there for our power just because cook has some pretty good power to it but we are rolling and as you may see it's got some wallowing to it so we may have to put a hold on the cook I might put a hold on the cook because I think it's pretty buggy I think they might have just put this one Christmas uh, because this thing can derail pretty quickly
as you may see, it likes to shake a lot. You can pick up a lot of speed really quickly. Granted, we were going kind of downhill. But we are flying. We're plowing that snow and we're doing the deed. But I gotta love the visual effects. When they work, they work. It's nice. When they don't, it sucks. So either the cook's a little buggy or I'm just saying it's buggy because I do not know how to operate. It might be operator's um, fault there. So you might have to see. What are you guys' thoughts on the cook and the snowplow here um, on this update in general? Uh, they did some bug fixes as well. Off the top of my head, I forgot which what they are, but I will be intrigued. Um, I know they changed the the Morse code on telegraph on the telegraph offices. So I'm interested to see what that sounds like. I don't think I really heard much. But I don't remember. I have to go back to the telegraph office and see what it sounds like to us. Get a nice rolling shot of the hook with the snow plow here. And we're just on the snow I said that like how many times 20 so I love the sound of the snow on the rails the snow plow on the rails it's pretty cool I like how they implemented that and like I like how the snow looks not sure if that's just my textures or what but I mean for what it is it's pretty nice a nice little addition to go along and it actually bounces off the ground which is also neat pretty neat to see pretty neat to see um the only bummer is you have to look like look right at it to see see any action and it actually goes off to the right too but which is pretty neat to see or could be i guess we're going right they're coming to the left, so it might come in, be coming off a little different to us. Bump up that regulator again. The snow is going to get pretty thick up here, so we got to make sure we don't get stalled out. Thick snow over here is bogging us down. How about that? So we'll get the snow plowed, and we will probably call that a video heat there. But I do appreciate you guys' support. It does mean a lot to me. It does mean a lot to me. You guys have been sticking around, watching the videos, hitting that like button, helping out the channel. Get some more rolling shots of the plow here. I'd figure you can't go too fast to plow, but so when we go flat out, you can hear it go up, pick up real quick. Do 20% on the reverser. Here's where the snow got really thick. It was windy, plowed up all right here. And you guys use your imagination. It's right all right there. We're doing some plowing. We're gonna get that snow gone so we can get that mosca right on through. Gotta make sure the snow can get over the mountain there. It's going, we're good, we're good on that aspect. But yeah, we're getting up, getting the snow gone and we're going.
just some ASMR sounds here with the scratching of the snowplow. Put some more reverser power to it. We are nearing the end here. I know they, they uh, did some scooping out here on the track, so we don't have to do too much plowing up here at the uh, iron mine. But I do appreciate anybody who has stuck around the video, stuck with this nonsense here. And it does mean a lot to me. We even got ourselves a little derail in the middle of it. So that is neat to see. But does mean a lot to me you guys have been sticking around watching the videos hitting that like button again let's try to get the video up to 60 likes and if you guys have stuck around this far that means you guys are either a subscriber or you guys are live in the videos so make sure you guys subscribe it does help out the algorithm helps out the streams and the videos everything else and it does mean so much to me you guys are here hanging out with me and i will see you guys in the next one with that being said the german soldier